G'day viewers, Jeff McCree's Gardening again. Uh, short video about the residential side of things. A um, couple of little properties that we got to show you and uh, a couple of little comments throughout the day. So a little bit uh, chop and start, stop and start here and there on the, on the video, but uh, please be, bear with us. Uh, we'll get better at it. It's just a matter of um, getting a sequence and getting it, uh, put a bit of planning. You know, I think uh, we do these off the bat. There's no uh, no rehearsal. It's just bang, put the record on and, and just do our bit. But I think to make a really good one, I think we probably need to sit down and uh, chart out a, a proper uh, a proper plan. So I'll, I'll do that for the next one when I talk about uh, the setup that I've got. Okay. How I approach to do a garden uh, lawn mowing job. Uh, this one uh, we're going to do is a regular every two weeks. Um, for 110 bucks, we get the lawns done. Uh, we get the gardens um, just tilled over and uh, all the leaves blowed. So it's quite a little um, reliable lawn and very good payers, which I like to have 100% good payers, but as we know, that's not always the way, but um, we're getting there. Alrighty then, so we'll, uh, we'll show you what we've got to do and uh, see what you think. Alrighty, here we go. Um, we've got a little corner block here. Um, we do this every... Uh, every fortnight so um, I'm going to do the uh, edges I use the Adam edger when I do the edges here um, just do the lawn area um, just till over the garden bed so I've got a little bit of um, weeds um, that pull out from time to time as you can see um, just the grass area here and it just stops stops around here right and from there on um, we go up to the back fence okay so weeding's done now we uh, we're just gonna blow um, blow all the weeds out and I've got a few weeds I've got to spray here but I'm not quite sure what's gonna happen so just get rid of all the all the weeds all the weeds we can blow them out onto the lawn so uh, most of my jobs I use the um, out of major, I find that to uh, do a nice, uh, nice edge. So we'll be using that today. I use that on most of my lawns.
Alrighty, that was uh, one of our residentials uh, that we've done today. Um, I've got about eight of those today. Uh, so they're not all the 110 garden. There's uh, a few 50s, a couple of 60s and 70s in there. Um, so all that takes me about four and a half hours. Um, it's pretty compact uh, here in this particular area I'm doing. Um, now that I've finished this one, you'll see a screenshot here. Uh, that's our invoice that we issued and that'll be um, paid probably tonight when the client uh, when the client uh, looks at his email so no seeing the client no cash transaction just all through EFT it's good and it's bad yeah it's nice to get a bit of cash but uh, 35 years ago it was 95 percent cash and now it's five percent cash so anyway we've got to pay our taxes I guess so and if you're a young fella and uh, you want a bit of a loan, you've got to put all your stuff through the books, which is important. Alrighty, I'm off to the next job and uh, we'll uh, see you later. Alright, we've uh, got a little small lawn here to do. Um, this one is every two weeks, like all, all my lawns. Uh, I have the odd one that will go three weekly in the winter, but generally every one's two weeks. And if I want to have a holiday, we'll just knock it down to four weeks and have those alternate weeks. But, but generally every one's um, two weeks. So, we'll have a look. Okay, these guys uh, I invoice by paper because they're not computer uh, savvy, so we just uh, write the invoice out and uh, we um, uh, get payment um, in um, a couple of days or they just bank it up next time and give me cash which which I like okay there's uh, ten lawns that I bowled over including uh, one was a garden and, and um, lawn and that was a total of six hundred and six hundred and twenty odd dollars for the day so um, left home at nine o'clock and uh, I'll get home at three so that, that's that's most days I um, try to only work five days a week, sometimes I get snagged for six, so I do have to work the Saturday for commercial, so I'll normally have a, um, uh, like a Friday or Sunday or a Sunday Monday off, but I've got, it's only every second Saturday I have to work anyway. My mix is 30% uh, um, commercial, 70% of residential gardening and lawn mowing. I don't rely on um, lawn mowing solely because as we've all seen over all the years we can have some severe droughts and it can put you out of business straight away whereas there's always some gardening to do, pruning, cleaning up etc. So make sure you keep your options open on uh, all aspects of gardening. A complete gardening service is what I reckon you need to do to survive in our game. Um, you know other, others, others have a different point of view but I've always worked on that philosophy. So for the guys who are only chasing residential and have only got the basic equipment or haven't got right on mowers or standers and all that fancy stuff, it's still a great dollar to be earned on the domestics. In fact, uh, the hourly rate um, is, is a lot higher than you can earn on commercially because you can do you know, two or three lawns together in an hour, you know, there's 150, 200 bucks in an hour you can earn, um, whereas commercially it's, it's pretty hard to earn all the time. And of course, sometimes if you're very lucky, you might get the cash jobs, and uh, that, that's that's. Of course, we always put that in the bank, naturally. But uh, that's nice to have. Thirty-five years ago, I was uh, uh, ninety-five percent cash. Now it's only five percent cash. So everybody's EFT, which is good because now I just email after each job, email um, invoice. They have to put the money in the bank that night or the next day. Um, and for people that uh, do pay cash, if they miss, uh, they can pop down to the bank or they just double pay me the next time. But the beauty of having the um, invoice arrangement is you don't have to worry about ringing up every customer. Oh, please don't forget to put the money in the meter box and uh, that can be a pain in the butt at times. So I don't have to ever worry about that. Anyway, so that's my little contribution to uh, the day in the life of. Um, I'm going to have a video on my setup and uh, I'll get into some detail there uh, of my little workshop and my um, ute and uh, ride on mower etc. So I'll, I'll hopefully do that in the next uh, week or so. But this one was just to show you the residential side of things. Uh, you've seen the video of the um, uh, commercial one I did the other day. So if you like it please subscribe down here. That little button 
button down there, I think, or that way. I can't remember which side will come on. But uh, please subscribe, and um, um, that will uh, that will make it uh, um, good for our page because this is all new to me, and it certainly uh, certainly make uh, a new outlet. You know, gives me a little bit of more enthusiasm now. So, but I'm really looking forward to seeing the other guys' uh, videos too. Where in our particular forum, a few of the guys are starting to put a few together and uh, gee, there's, some, there's, there's going to be some great information um, exchanged on those. You're going to learn so much from them and I'm still learning from other people's uh, YouTube videos. I reckon it's great. Okay, have a good day.